I want you to focus on the market rent. The market rent, 1300 I ain't fluffing you. I ain't making that up, folks. Wait, that's it. That's it. Oh, it's right there. Oh, you were You're right. right you were right there. I was I wrong. that I was correct. Here's Portland. Here's Portland. Yeah. Here's Portland. It's very nice. Dude, that's Portland. Oh, yeah. That's 333. Three, three, three. There it is. I don't know. Well, roll your window down. What the f***? I don't know. So, uh, unfortunately, we don't have any interior uh, photos or video for you at this time. However, uh, when you do make your offer, we'll be able to make a contingent on an inspection. This is like the flats. I really hope that when they view yeah, this. Yeah, we saw this. <laughs> That's the solar panel. Solar panel. Dude, panel. I really hope when they review this, it's... <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, it's going just... stupid, bro. <laughs> it's... 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 on X <laughs> Oh, dude. I've had enough. <laughs> you can't drink it anymore. Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sales Show. Folks, saying it's selling at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch to you. Giving it to you straight. Want to talk to you guys about Section 8 and the city of Toledo, man. Two things I love. Chicken wings and beer. Now, I should have said Section 8 in Toledo because that's what this video is about. It's not about chicken wings and beer, although can I get a shout-out for buffalo sauce. But seriously, folks, what we got to do today, we got to talk to you all about Section 8, right? Because I got a big Section 8 opportunity for you in the Toledo market. 333 Cortland, all right? Now, I like Toledo. For those of you that haven't heard of Toledo, right? Toledo's a cash flow market, man. Toledo is a cash cow. Toledo's in the Midwest. We get a lot of folks coming to the Midwest, right? Y'all want to invest out here because we have low-cost properties, cheap properties, and lines and lines and lines and lines of tenants with government-guaranteed vouchers. Toledo is a nice little hot spot. Now, it's a smaller city, okay? It's not as big, right? Toledo is geographically located uh, between... Uh, Detroit and Cleveland, right? Detroit and Cleveland are both admittedly more popular markets than Toledo, right? I myself uh, am headquartered, Holton Wise, our headquarters. We operate in all of Ohio, uh, but we are actually headquartered in Cleveland, Ohio, and we do a lot of business throughout the entire state of Ohio. So I know all about Cleveland. Uh, Toledo, it's like an hour and a half, two hours east of us, or west of us, rather, west of us, and it's south of Detroit, okay? And there's a lot of opportunity out there, opportunities like this particular property, right? Three through three Cortland, Priced at $34.9, folks. $34.9, and we have $700 a month coming in. But that's not what I want you to focus on. I want you to focus on the market rent. The market rent, $1,300. I ain't fluffing you. I ain't making that up, folks. This is a long-term tenant who was placed in this property by the local Toledo landlord. Uh, they placed them in this property several years ago. Uh, do I believe they placed them in there at market rent at that time? No, but they were not too far off of market rent when they did place them in. Uh, Toledo, much like Detroit, much like Cleveland, has seen an incredible, incredibly massive increase in market rents over the last few years, right? It's pretty much all over the country, right? So right now, I would say with the fact that we have three beds and two baths, right? That second bath gets you a little more money when you're working with Section 8. I'd say we can get the, the rent all the way up to 1300 on this. Now, I don't have have interior footage for you truth be told uh we're dealing with a difficult tenant here right getting inside of these properties uh when you're buying properties on the low end of the pricing spectrum in toledo slash in the entire freaking country where else can you get 1300 in rent for thirty five thousand dollars? like nowhere uh you're not always going to deal with the easiest going tenant base they really don't like people coming in their property and bothering them right and that that's always been that way i've been in the game like 10 11 years now uh, no, even longer. Uh, I, I've been actively selling real estate as a broker uh, 20, 2013, so 10 years, but I've actually been in the game, bought my first house. It was a house hack. Uh, what was that, 09? So it's like 14 years. I've been in the game 14 years, right? Uh, and I'll tell you this. Tenants have never been easy to deal with, especially low-income tenants, especially Section 8 tenants, in that entire time period. I've sold $200 million worth of real estate here in Ohio, folks. Never, ever, ever, ever is dealing with Section 8 tenants ever been easy. But I'll tell you what. After COVID hit, that really changed the game, and it really made things very, very difficult. So uh, unfortunately, we don't have any interior 
uh, photos or video for you at this time. However, uh, when you do make your offer, we'll be able to make a contingent on an inspection. And there's going to be some legwork involved in us coordinating that inspection uh, with the tenants, with the owner. Uh, but we will get you in there. We will get your inv uh, inspectors in there, but it's not going to be easy. It could take like a week or so to actually get that going, right? So because of that, when we sell tenant-occupied properties, folks, don't think that you could just contact Holton Wise and be like, no, I want to go tour the property. We don't play that shit, man. No. You got to have an offer contingent on an inspection just to verify everything is up to snuff, is accurately depicted here. Uh, but don't think you can just go on whenever you want. No, you got to be a serious, ready, willing, and able buyer. You have to put up proof of funds, pre-approval. Prior to that inspection, you got to pay an actual licensed inspector because we want a commitment out of you if we're putting in the human capital and all the labor it takes to actually corral a difficult Section 8 tenant into allowing us in the property. Now, that said, uh, let's make sure we're on the same page here. Do not anticipate going into this property that's on sale for 35 k uh, that has a long-term low-income tenant in there who's paying $600 a month less than what they should be paying, who's paying like half of market rent, and anticipate the property to be beautiful. No, 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 no. When this tenant moves out, I guarantee you, before you could put in a new tenant, you're going to need to repaint everything. There's probably going to be some holes in the walls. You're probably going to need to replace some kitchen cabinets, bathroom fixtures. You might even need to do new vinyl flooring in the kitchen, the bath. And if there's carpet, that carpet's fucking trashed. You're going to need to replace it with new carpet, refinish the existing hardwoods that are under the carpet, or put down vinyl or flooring. As long as we are on the same page with that, you've seen in the chart, right? We've had the chart up several times in the video. You've seen the age of the mechanicals, right? We're looking at a six-year-old roof. Uh, a furnace at least 10 years old, hot water tank at least 13 years old, right? So don't go ahead and come in here, put in your offer, do your inspection, and come back to us like, oh, I'll buy the property anymore because I think the hot water tank is going to break soon. No shit, Sherlock. Hot water tanks in Toledo last like 15 years. This some bitch is about 13 and a half to 14 years old, so I'll tell you right now, you're going to need a new hot water tank in the next one to two years most likely. So don't don't play that shit, folks. Uh, so if you're a serious investor, though, who understands what you're getting, who understands Section 8 investing, who understands the Toledo market, you know damn well that the particular house you're able to pick up here is a hell of a deal, especially with the, the fact that there's $600 a month potential rental increases here. If all that sounds good to you and you are ready to rock and roll, send your offers to my team, sales at holtonwise.com. Include proof of funds, pre-approval, and let you get you going on some Section 8 investing in Toledo today. It's after the alley, so figure out if the alley's in between these houses. Oh, this <laughs> second driveway is the alley. So is this the alley? Three 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 four. No, that's yeah, that's it. Three 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 four. Oh yeah, that's three two two. Three three three. There it is. I don't know. Well, roll right your window down. What the fuck? Go down that way. Go down. down. Yeah. Three rights make a left. There it is. It's in good shape. It's in good condition. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't even... That's how it could have been in the It would have. It definitely would have. Dude, I guarantee you if we knock on the door, they'll let us in. Like, it looks... It, it looks... Because I'm going to go up, Cortland, and then you just film it kind of like Pete did, but go on the other way. Yeah, that's fine, dude. I'm, I'm still filming. Okay, I've cool. just been filming the whole time. Nice. Well, that's good. Well, then we can get this piece of shit boarded up right here. That's good. Wait, on the left or right hand side? Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh yeah, he's a nice piece of shit. <laughs> well, don't get in any trouble, cause uh, get whackers off. How am I gonna get in any trouble? <laughs> Turn it on. <laughs> the house is back the other way. Yeah. I didn't. Are you sure it's gonna recognize? I don't recognize any of this. I didn't recognize Yeah, you went the wrong way. Looks like fuck. Wait, that's it. That's it. Oh, it's right there. Oh, you You're were right. right you were right there. Fuck you! Well, yeah, I was I wrong. Heard that I was correct. Here's Cortland. And here's Cor yeah. Here's Cortland. It's very nice. <laughs> very nice. Oh, yeah. There's people living in the house. It's, just, it's on. It's that's. It's doing that itself. Why? Why is it it's on a point? Possessed. This better be the best fucking. They better have fucking 60 percent view. I mean, it looks cool. 
Oh my god, now it's... Look at... <laughs> Dude, look at this shit! Oh Jesus my god. Christ, this Fuck! Dude, the gimbal's broken. The brand new gimbal just doesn't work. Look at it. It's possessed by the devil. So apparently there's almost no bark. Oh, Alright, I'm sorry for yelling. <laughs> you can go out here and make a left. There's a parking lot on, on the street too. I've seen it. See? This is like the flats. I really hope that when they view this. Hey, we saw this. There's a fucking. <laughs> oh, that's a solar panel. Solar plant. Dude, I really hope when they review this. It's. <laughs> Going stupid, bro. Yeah. It's <laughs> the fucking gibbles on X Games. <laughs> where, where I had you turn around. Yeah, right here. <laughs> <laughs> the fucking gibbles going crazy, bro. Oh, dude. Oh, God, I've had enough! <laughs> I can't take it anymore! I gotta turn this off. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.